And new tonight, a 23-year-old man injured in an oil battery explosion in Weld County over the weekend is now on life support. And tonight, Denver 7 speaks to his girlfriend as he fights for his life. His Denver 7's Tom Mustin. It's just been really hard. D. Ray Caro is hoping for a miracle. When I first heard it, I just knew something was really wrong. Last Saturday, her longtime boyfriend, Dylan Dreyer, was nearly killed after an oil battery explosion in Weld County. Yes. He's been in a medically induced coma ever since, with several surgeries planned for the next few weeks. He's trying to move, he's trying to open his eyes, so I think he can feel our presence there. Dylan and D-Ray are both 23 years old. Their daughter, Lily, is three. Pictures show a loving couple and a doting father. Sometimes he would work 18 hour shifts and he would still always say goodnight to Lily. You know, he's just a great person. Dylan has worked for two years for the Greeley company Element Services. He had been working on an oil battery in Briggsdale when stray oil inside ignited. The explosion injured three workers and one of them saved Dylan's life. He saw Dylan on the floor with his head in the dirt and he was on fire. Threw Dylan over his shoulder and brought him to the end of the road. Dylan suffered second and third degree burns over 60% of his body. The sheriff's office says Dylan had been using old equipment when the explosion happened. D-Ray says he had voiced concerns before about the dangers of his job. So that's fair to say that he, he had been concerned about some safety issues. Probably. Yeah, and he, he worked for our family. Element wouldn't comment on the accident, but sent us a statement saying in part, quote, our immediate concern is with Dylan and his family. And now with a long road ahead, D-Ray is hoping that somehow the love of her life will pull through. I just want people to pray for Dylan and hope that he pulls through and fights. Tom Mustin, Denver 7. And we wish Dylan the